All right. This is my 89KX500. I've done a little bit of work to it since my last video, but uh, done some small things like uh, the head gasket. It started seeping out a little bit because I guess it, from sitting for so long, this bike really hasn't been used that much. Um, but it's, I've actually, I, I really got to take it out for its first ride, and I took it out on a entry level motocross track, and it. It really is unbelievable what this bike can do. Just power when you need it, and it's really actually uh, very usable power also. Uh, unlike a 250, 250s are kind of unpredictable. This bike, I think, is, to me anyways, it's a little bit more predictable. But uh, I'm trying to get a decent shot about it because it's in my shed here and it's a little tight. And, Anyways, it's it runs awesome. A uh, few things I've done. Uh, of course, I needed a new rear tire because the original tire that I just took off of it can't really see it, but it uh, it was in dire need of a tire. Other than that, I did some bark busters up here and some new handlebars. I just wanted to replace them because the old ones were all scratched up a little bit. But uh, other than that, it it's awesome. The power is just unreal. I really don't have any desire for a new four-stroke. <sighs> Gotta lose the graphics. That is very, very much 80s. Uh, and I don't think they're quite original. They were probably put on around the same era of the bike. Um, I can try to find the originals. Kind of going with a somewhat retro look with this bike. I don't want to modernize it too much. Kind of like to keep the old school of the bike. But... She is a hoss. I think they're putting out about 65 horsepower. I don't know. I've heard 75. I've heard 65. I've heard 55. I don't know. I don't care. She's a widow maker. It's another bike I got. It's for sale. I'm trying to get a thousand bucks for it. It's a good running bike. I like older bikes. I don't know why. Uh, I wish I can zoom out, but there she is.